hello and welcome to a brand new episode of wordpress tutorials uh, today i'm going to show you how to get uh, the currency symbol for a woocommerce website for example uh, this is a website and if you uh, go to the store uh, then you can see that uh, there is the currency symbol uh, with the price and uh, the reason uh, you should need this is that if you create a custom plugin and uh, you want to tell uh, people a specific price or you want to tell them which currency you want you are uh, trading in uh, then uh, we can make it automated because uh, we never know uh, on which currency website the, uh, the user will install that plugin okay uh, so for example I'm creating a new uh, custom template uh, I already copied the page template uh, and I copied this one and uh, named it the custom template and here it is uh, page name custom template and let's create a new uh, page with that template page add new maybe uh, you are adding this code to a plugins page uh, but for testing purpose uh, i created this new template uh, to show you how uh, how it works uh, there are uh, many ways you can get the currency symbol uh, i'll show you three three ways in this video okay here we are uh, let's name our page uh, let's say currency for example currency and page attributes the template will be custom page uh, which I already showed you that this one I just created okay page custom page and publish this page okay now uh, let's view this page uh, in front end Okay, here you can see that there is no content uh, in this page so let's add a bit of contents and publish Uh, now come to the template and in the main content area uh, above all the contents we mentioned uh, type here echo get option currency commerce currency and let's see what happens okay this is uh, what it's showing uh, using this function uh, but maybe uh, you need the symbol uh, not uh, not actually the currency which is the Great Britain pound and the symbol for that uh, can be done using this function get woocommerce currency symbol and use this gbp within this function and save now refresh the page now you can see that uh, it's converted to the symbol okay uh, there is one more thing uh, which you can use for example if you are uh, if you are 
showing a custom price like uh, custom price is equal to 60 for example and you want to use the this symbol with it then uh, there are also two ways to show it you can use exact same function and concatenate the price custom price refresh the page so uh, let's remove this space from here okay uh, but there is also another way which is uh, echo wc price and dollar sign custom price okay, it's the wrong place here refresh the page now you can see that this and this uh, does have uh, this currency symbol but this one is a default WooCommerce uh, WooCommerce function uh, which is WC price and the price you want to mention it will automatically uh, get the currency and will use the uh, price value and concatenate both and show you the price uh, the, the another another example is like if you want to tell the user that we are dealing in and then use that currency this one here we are dealing in GBP so your customers will get a message like this we are dealing in pound uh, no matter what currency uh, is the website owner uses then uh, in this uh, in your uh, creator plugin the currency symbol will be that one which is uh, used by that store okay please uh, let me know if you uh, want to know anything about this video uh, let me know in the comments below and please give us a thumbs up on this video and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any future update thank you